Okay, para naman sa square of binomial. So, pag sinabing square of binomial, so let's say we have x plus y squared. So, we, we square the binomial. So, by exponent definition, so this means x plus y times x plus y. Diba? So, uh, we multiply the base by itself two times. So, x plus y times x plus y. So, as a special products, kapag uh, square of binomials, so, sabi doon, uh, we just square the first term. Square the first term. Okay? And then, plus twice the product of the first and last term plus square the last term. So, yan yung ating steps. Again, square the first term twice the product of the first and last term plus square of the last term. So, x plus y squared is equal to x squared plus 2xy plus y squared. Okay, let's try another example. So, let's say we have Let's say we have uh, m plus 3 squared. Okay? So, first, we square the first term. Square the first term. So, the first term is m. Pa? Isin natin. So, the first term is M. The second term is 3. Okay. M squared plus twice. So, lagi pong constant si ha. The first and the last term. And then plus square the last term. So, M squared plus 2 times 3 is 6 times m is 6m and then plus 3 times 3 is 9 so this is the product okay so let's have another example again square of a binomial so kung minus na, kung minus itong ating operation ang middle term natin ay subtraction then okay so another example so gamitin naman natin yung subtraction so let's say we have uh, 2a minus 4 uh, 5b minus 5b ayan so, 2a minus 5b. So, first term is 2a. Last term is 5b. Then, ang operation ay negative. So, apply natin. Square the first term. So, the first term is 2a squared. And then, dahil subtraction, so minus twice again constant lagi yung 2 so the product of the first which is 2a sorry the product is uh, again twice the product of the first and last and then plus square of the last term okay so, let's simplify now. 2a squared is the same as 2a times 2a. So, that is 4a squared minus 
2 times 2 is 4 times 5 is 20. And then, copy the variable since wala silang magkaparehas. So, just rewrite or copy. So, that is 20AB plus 5B times 5B is the same as 5 times 5 is 25. And then, B times B is B squared. So, this is the product. Okay, now let's have the product of the sum and difference of two of two terms. So, as you observe here, ang ating binomials ay parehas sila ng first term and parehas sila ng last term. Pero ang operation natin dito ay plus and then dito naman ay subtraction. Kapag ganyan daw yung ating minumultiply, ang product natin lagi is equal to x squared or square of the first term and square of the last term. So, laging subtract yung operation. So, x squared minus y squared. So, ang uh, ibig sabihin, yung product ng sum and difference of two terms is always the square or the difference of the squares of the first term and the last term. So, to understand you to understand it better, so let's have an example. So let's have we have let's say we have two um, a two a plus six times two a minus six. So as you observe, parehas tayo ng first term, parehas ng last term. Pero, plus at saka subtraction ang ang operation. So, to get the product, sabi dito, square the first term minus square the last term. So, the first term is 2a. So, 2a parenthesis squared minus 6 is the second term then squared. So, this will be the product. So, since may parenthesis pa at may exponent pa, so, isi-simplify natin. So, 2a times 2a is 4a squared. Bakit? 2 times 2 is 4. a times a is a squared. We just add the exponent. And then, minus 6 times 6 is... 36. So, this is the product.